Your CBS 17 Storm Team forecast first at 4. Good afternoon once again, and we know it's been a warm day, a warm string of days as that sort of last stretch of summer hold on as the heat and humidity rolls back in. So let's take it live outside, not just here in Raleigh, but all across central North Carolina, where we see at least some beautiful blue sky. Not as many clouds as in the past few days, but still a few clouds out there, not offering much shade or relief from the heat as temperatures for many of us climbing to the upper 80s and even the low 90s. Now, as you can get out and enjoy the rest of the evening, and it is going to be warm temperatures. Holding on to the upper 70s, low 80s, as you're taking your dog out for a walk. Something to keep in mind. By tomorrow morning, we're still going to have warm conditions in place. Likely going to start out in the upper 60s, maybe even some of us into the low 70s, before we have one more warm afternoon before that cold front arrives and usher in some slightly cooler air, dare I say, even say fall like weather. Now, of course, we've been talking about it a lot. We know that the last full day of summer is today, as fall starts tomorrow, or at least the equinox. Equinox takes place tomorrow night. So, what exactly is the equinox and how does that impact our seasons and, you know, what causes all of that? Okay, so we have a graphic here for you. And basically, as the Earth makes its yearly orbit around the sun, different parts of the Earth are exposed to the sun at different times of the year. But the Earth is actually tilted by 23 and a half degrees. It's this tilt that causes the four seasons we experience every year. An equinox happens twice a year in the spring and in the fall. The fall equinox happens tomorrow. Tomorrow at 9:03 p.m. That's the exact moment the sun crosses the equator. So on the day of the equinox, you'll see the sun directly overhead at noon. There is almost, but not quite, 12 hours of day and 12 hours of night, and the sun will rise due east and set due west. And we all know that fall around here is kind of a state of mind, at least for a bit, until that cooler air actually moves in. But we've been talking about it a lot. I know it's a broken record. The cooler air is on the way. You know, just have a little patience. Light your fall candle. That cooler air will eventually arrive. Live in Raleigh, meteorologist Rachel Dunzing, CBS 17.